good morning my dear students our lesson name is air children do you know about air yes we have already learned about air students we know air is present everywhere around us air is necessary for us to live we can live without food for some days without water for a few hours but cannot survive without air for more than a few minutes so air is very important for all living beings to survive and students what is air air is a mixture of gases like nitrogen carbon dioxide oxygen and water vapor what is the composition of air we know air is a mixture of gases so the composition of air in terms of percentage of its various components can be written as follows see here the major component of air is nitrogen what is the major component of air nitrogen because nitrogen is present 78 percentage of air and second major component of air is oxygen in addition to nitrogen and oxygen gases air also contains small amount of carbon dioxide water vapor and some other gases like argon helium etc the air may also contain some dust particles students can we see air no we cannot see air but we can feel its presence in so many ways for example pages of an open book flutters when the fan is switched on flutter of a flag in a gentle breeze when kites fly in the sky we cannot see touch or taste air but we can feel it and students air is used in so many ways for example oxygen gas is used for breathing and it is used for burning process nitrogen gas gives fertility of soil carbon dioxide is used in photosynthesis and air is used for so many other purposes like sailing hair drying flying balloons parachuting kite flying and students our earth also surrounded by a huge envelope of air called the atmosphere our atmosphere extends to more than 800 km above the surface of earth the atmosphere protects us from many harmful rays coming from the sun the air envelope is thicker near the earth's surface and as we go higher the density and the availability of air gradually decreases this is because as we go higher the force of gravity decreases so it is not able to hold large amount of air and students our atmosphere is made of five different layers first layer troposphere second stratosphere and third mesosphere and fourth ionosphere and fifth one exosphere and which is the first layer of this atmosphere troposphere and students troposphere is the first layer troposphere is the layer closest to the earth this layer is very closest to the earth it is the layer in which we live it extends upwards for about 16 km above the surface of the earth movement of wind takes place in this layer it also contains water vapor which is responsible for making clouds this layer is responsible for the weather we experience on earth aircrafts usually fly above this layer to avoid strong winds and bad weather next layer is stratosphere the stratosphere lies above the troposphere this layer has the ozone layer in it the ozone layer protects all life on earth from the harmful ultraviolet rays of the sun and the next layer is mesosphere it is the third layer of the atmosphere directly above the stratosphere 
meso means middle and this is the highest layer of the atmosphere so which is the highest layer of the atmosphere mesosphere and which is the third layer of the atmosphere mesosphere meso means middle and next ionosphere that ionosphere layer it contains thermosphere in its so ionosphere is ionized by solar radiation it is a very active part of the atmosphere and it grows and shrinks depending on the energy it absorbs so this is the fourth layer of the atmosphere and next step, fifth layer is exosphere so which is the fifth layer exosphere it is the outermost layer of the earth's atmosphere exo means outside air in the exosphere is extremely thin so what are the five layers of the atmosphere troposphere stratosphere mesosphere ionosphere and exosphere which is the uh, which layer is the closest to the earth troposphere and which is the second layer stratosphere and which is the third layer mesosphere and outer layer exosphere okay students so i hope composition of air and atmosphere thank you children